Monday. It's time for today's Is This Anything with my boys over at WIBC. Hammer and Nigel joining us now. Hey, you guys, Hello. how's it going? Beautiful day outside, and by beautiful, I mean very cloudy, but I got a few beers in me, and I'm in a good mood. That's right, as you do normally at this time of day. I love it. <laughs> Let's dive right in. Let's start here with the Pacers. Okay, competing for a spot in the playoffs tonight. Is this anything? Yes, this is something. Uh, so this is a new thing that the NBA is doing. They came up with this idea for a play-in tournament. Mm -hmm. They thought too many teams are tanking and losing games on purpose down the stretch. So if more teams have a chance to make the playoffs, maybe that will eliminate some of that. Right. And the Pacers technically didn't make the playoffs, but they get to host a play-in game tonight. 6.30 against the Charlotte Hornets. I like the Pacers in the situation. I bet on the Pacers tonight. Uh, I'm ready to go. Sabonis in the lineup. Yes. And uh, Gordon Hayward is out for the Hornets. So I'm in. I'm ready to go. I think this is exciting. The NBA trying to create a little bit of that March Madness kind of uh, like drama. And uh, I think this is an exciting thing. Yes, this is something. Okay. So it's worth the hype. We should all tune in and watch. Well, there. as much hype as a nine versus ten game can be, but yes, it's, it's yeah. win or go home tonight, and that's, that's right. kind of all you're asking for. I love it. I love it. Okay, now we got to get to this. This is big news. Burger King. Okay, big <laughs> night. They're bringing back something that has been off the menu for a decade. It is the return of the crown-shaped nuggets. The nuggies are back. Anything. Is this anything? The crown-shaped nuggets making their triumphant return to Burger King <laughs> after a decade. My goodness, let's celebrate. This is something. First of all, my very first job ever in life. Once I turned 16, my dad told me to hit the pavement. I went straight to Burger King in Brownsburg right off the right off 74. I was the best Whopper flopper ever. <laughs> I worked as much as I could. Um, I in knew fact, I remember the one time I got in Whopper trouble, flopper. somebody... Whopper flopper, yes. Well, the one time I got in trouble, though, the guy uh, ordered a uh, Whopper extra pickles, and I remember just digging both my hands <laughs> into the pickle jar and laying about 500 pickles on his Whopper <laughs> and wrapping it up. Oh, this guy wants extra pickles. He'll get extra pickles. Oh, so man. I got in big trouble for that. But I love Burger King. And the funny thing about this crown chicken nugget thing is 2,000 people signed an online petition that is to insane. bring this back. <laughs> of course they you know, did. America. You know, yeah, of course. Right. You, you see so, certain people taking time to create petitions for, for hunger and other things like that. <laughs> These people, by the thousands, signed a petition to get Burger King to bring the crown chicken nuggets back. Yes, this is something. Oh, and man. by the way, uh, when Nigel goes to the pool, Whopper Flopper is still his nickname. <laughs> often chant for him whopper flopper <laughs> whopper i love it I, I have a question for you hammer are you going to do this petition to bring back the mexican pizza to taco bell or have you know what may, maybe somebody start needs it. to start this not all heroes wear capes and if i have to be the guy <laughs> that leads the brigade to bring back the mexican pizza then so be it as you guys know i give the people what they want exactly. and if this is what they want then Let's go. Let's dance. I love it. And I want more Whopper Flopper time. That's what I'm saying. You guys are the <laughs> best. Thank you so much. Let's do it again tomorrow, shall we?